Hi, I'm Katie Ella de Klerk and welcome to my channel. I'm going to be working on a series from my Ink October that I managed to make shorter from Twitch. Uh, today's topic is fancy. I thought I'd be using these um, triangle things or uh, tracer things a lot more in this exercise which I actually avoided to do as I try to do everything freehand. There are only a few things I touch up with a ruler, but there is the ever so popular um, Everflow pen that I use with watercolor to get those gray textures in. Um, I thought I would be only doing one tile, but it turns out in the end result that I did three. I like the unpredictability that the Everflow pen or the watercolor pen brings and then also the straightforward strokes that the fine liner pen could bring to the project. I thought of doing a type of Indian feel with a peacock feather, a slight moon facing thing, which um, turns, looks out like quite symbolic, like sundial, a sundial, but that's not what I was initially going for. point of the design I choose to draw two different techniques or two different styles and I actually asked the um, audience if they could comment on which one looks a bit stronger. I end up going with the one on the right hand side as it's more suited to what my initial idea was, not the, the sundial but as the peacock feathers. You can see in the end result I did use gold to bring in different elements of the patterns and designs. This isn't in the video but it is in my end result. I just took gold paint afterwards, not gold leaf, um, but it worked out just the same. And this is at that point where I don't really know what I'm doing with the, the two elephant ears that are happening with a big space so I decided to do another tile shooting out the bottom there which is more simple because um, I think I don't have that much time but then again I have enough time to create a third tile so <laughs> everything can fast forward I think this is also the point where I was like I don't know what I'm going to do with those four spaces around that circle So I felt I needed to bring in another element to just bring in some difference instead of bringing in squares and making them black and making it darker than it needed to be. This tile has more of a kitchen feel to it than it did with the more indie one. And the other one that I start doing now has more of an Art Nouveau feel to it. Um, I think I had just watched The Great Gatsby, so I really enjoyed all those straight lines and wanted to incorporate that into uh, my inspiration. Here I am at the final stages of the tiles, just uh, touching up with those black and the white. Um, just trying to create the navigation where um, each individual tile is individual and then still wondering if I should add in the gold. I think I'm also wondering if I could have time to do another tile but yet I don't so I actually write in the Ink October slogan on the right hand side which is the same as when I did it on um, the radio. So it's not the only one I use that one on. Hi, I just want to say thank you to the people that tuned into my channel to watch it and are currently liking and sharing all my videos. It really helps me out. Um, if you want to see more of my videos, please go to YouTube or to see my final products on Instagram or my Facebook page, Katie Declerc Art. But otherwise, enjoy your day. Cheers, bye.